Hi, my name is Bianca Leonard. I'm at the Yasa Lab here at UCI. I'm an MD PhD student in my fourth year of the program, my second year of PhD. My research is focused on mental illness. I am interested in learning about what the origins of mental illness are to structure how it is that mental illnesses come about. As an MD-PhD student, I am always thinking about how the basic science concepts of neuroscience connect to real world consequences for my future patients. Young is coming at trying to understand neuropsychiatric illness from an applied lens, trying to understand how neuroscience can inform what we do in the clinic, what we do in practice, and how we can help patients. And my work up to this point has really been much more on the mechanistic neuroscience side. And I think marrying those two together, trying to understand how is it that mechanisms are involved in neuropsychiatric illness, and, and importantly, down the line, understanding how they can impact things like recovery or treatments, um, that's a really important direction for the field. This program has really, really incredible developmental events, and that includes the courses, neural dynamics, which totally challenge my understanding of neural computation and the types of questions that can be asked. I'm really looking forward to the different workshops that are going on, and then most importantly is the community. The mentorship of different professors and sharing this space of science is honestly a dream come true. <laughs> so I, yeah, I'm incredibly excited. My favorite part about being a grad student is getting to travel to different conferences. Part of the graduate school journey for me has been learning to be patient with growth. And I've been physically manifesting this by starting a garden. Agriculture is a big part of my family. My mom's side of the family had the best cattle in the entire country of Honduras, so I'm very proud of them for that. And I even have their like hometown featured in, in a painting right here. I keep it on my desk and it's a really important part of my identity, but also practicing the humility of growth through grad school.